Hey, yo, back with another little video. I'm gonna be popping these out as fast as I can, just so I can get them out of the way, so I can hurry up on my new montage. Um, it will be out soon. Anyway, so this is for the XM4 in Warzone, Rebirth, and Verdance. So starting off with the muzzle, we use the agency suppressor, just for the effective damage range, bullet velocity, sound suppression. And, but the good thing about the agency suppressor over the normal one is that it has vertical recoil control, which I didn't think it had that, so that's why I was using my suppressor. But the barrel using the 13.5 inch task force, it is better than the reinforced heavy. I did look at the stats. No, not just these stats. I did look at these, but also they like, read them and everything. So the 13.5 inch task force is the better option. Just because the it gives like five percent extra damage range, I've heard. Anyway, the laser is just steady aim laser for the hip fire accuracy because I hit fire a lot. If you don't hit fire that much, I think you should use the SOF target designator. Effective damage range and fire accuracy. Effective damage range would always be good. But for the stock, use the buffer tube. It's basically like the Cold War version of the no stock. So, just extra sprint to fire time and mobility. Ammunition use the 45 round magazine. Um, I don't use the uh, 40 round, 45 round speed mag because the ADS time goes down. So, and ADS is pretty, it's decently important on this weapon. So, I kind of need that. I don't use an under barrel, an optic. If you are going for more of a longer range this is more like for verdansk you could take this off and put on whatever optic you would like i recommend the royal and cross four times and the aerial arms three times if you want or if you're playing rebirth and you want to scope do the vision tech two times but i just recommend steady aim laser for now um, anyway, so, uh, go subscribe, and, uh, subscribe to my friend Snipes, he's gonna be changing his name back to Carnage once he gets an XP token on Call of Duty and YouTube, and watch the video you see in front of you.